A struggling movie theater in Kitsap County was just saved. And it is thanks to the generosity of strangers touched by the owner's passion for the cinema. Only Cairo 7's Tracy Leong spoke to the owner who says he's really surprised by this overwhelming support. It was less than a month ago that Craig Smith was planning on closing his movie theater, something he built 10 years ago. But with a little national publicity, people reached out to keep his dream of a small town theater alive. Firehouse Theater, it's Craig. Here at the Firehouse Theater, Craig Smith does it all. And it's way better to be prepared because when there's customers and you're on a time frame, sound good. Because, you know, you got showtime. A little secret about soda machines. You want the carbonation to be strong. You got to keep it cold. So I put a little over two cups of seed. I uh, used coconut oil instead of, you know, canola oil. I go up and down these steps a lot. <laughs> That's real butter. We don't use that chemical stuff. Here's the projectors. This is uh, what we call the main stage theater. I'm going to be starting the pre-show. And everyone who walks into his theater is treated like family. The heat is on. He even offers a personal introduction of the movies to welcome patrons to his cozy theater. Really well acted, very moving. It won uh, editing. Smith turned an old firehouse into the firehouse theater 10 years ago, poured his life savings into it to fulfill a childhood dream. But like many small town theaters, he struggled to keep it running. A lot of people just are unaware what it costs to maintain. It's a high overhead, low profit business. Five, ten, here you go. It was looking up bankruptcy lawyers because we were forced to go digital. Um, I've almost closed down five or six times. As Smith started to lose hope, the community gave him a reason not to. His son created a GoFundMe page. We had $6,000 in the first week. Then that CBS Sunday morning show aired. And by noon of Sunday, I had $100,000. That national spotlight on Smith's theater reached thousands of people. There you go. Who were touched by his dedication and wanted to help. And the good people all across the United States, five and ten dollars. I had no idea. I mean, I know what the term going viral means now. I'm Craig. I'm Diane. Diane, you're here to help, yes, right? Yes, I'm here yes. to help. Strangers okay. showing their support uh, to preserve this 65-year-old movie it lover's it passion. It gives me hope that this is going to continue. Uh, it's just amazing that other people have that same sense. I think it's one of the greatest living arts. So thanks for coming. Enjoy the show, and I hope to see you again. I know some of you traveled a ways. I really appreciate it. While Craig says it's the GoFundMe page that saved his theater, it's really movie lovers who crave this traditional experience that will keep it going for years. I'm Trace Leong reporting in Kingston for Cairo 7 News.